Hey, best you want to back to my channel. She's going to have Priestess Mar. Back on more tea, back on another read. So, we're going to go right in, Aries, and see what's going on. Um, You definitely could be dealing with a Scorpio. I'm here. I was here and say what you need to say. Say what you need to say. So, somebody could definitely have something on their mind. They've been holding it back for a while now, though. Hi, Pop, Archangels, Ancestors, Gods, and Goddesses. Please take me and my bestie, Aries, as we get into this read. Please take our energy from any unwanted souls or other entities. Please give us the clarity and the truth. Please surround us with your love and guide us with your wisdom always and forever. Higher power, our dangerous ancestors, the divine law, and light only. Amen. So, yeah, I feel like whatever somebody got to stay, it's been illuminated. And somebody could have been in like some discarded masculine energy. Yeah, that's what it's giving me. Somebody's going to shine a light on this. Ooh, we got divine feminine, but it's coming out crossing. Okay. I feel like this divine feminine here is seductive. Seduction. She got a way about herself. Look at her eyes. It's piercing. It's like she just lure you in. It's like, I'm here humming her, humming her, humming her, humming her. Like, hypnosis. Somebody could have, and you see how her breast is like exposed. I feel like somebody, maybe they dress a little provocative or they're very fruitful though. This is a real divine feminine, but it's giving me like somebody could have misjudged the divine feminine or something here. You know, with the parrot, I'm hearing Polly had a cracker. Polly had a cracker? I feel with this parrot here, they, they you know, archangels, ancestors, God, the goddesses. You know, birds represent messages. So I feel like somebody works very closely with the divine. Um, they get messages from the divine here. This divine feminine. They get some type of resources. I'm also hearing re rehab. Shivery is still at the bottom of the deck. Definitely that Gemini re Scorpio could definitely be very significant here. But somebody's being bold about something. Okay, somebody's being bold about whether. I'm here naked and afraid. Hmm. Somebody's been exposed, okay? Something, somebody, whether they're exposing something or they're being exposed, something's being put all out there on the table for the world to see. It's like, okay, I'm just going to say this now, and I don't want to, I'm here to speak now, forever heard your peace. So somebody definitely could be getting married. But before this happens, I feel like somebody's going to um say something. The month of March can vary. Very much so be significant here. Congratulations. Somebody could be saying congratulations. They really a hater. If this is somebody telling somebody congratulations, they really a hater. Um... Also hearing strong odor. Possums is like uh the, the, the little be going snooping in the garbage and shit. Somebody could be homeless. Uh, strong odor is what I just heard as well. What the moon what is this? Let's let's get some clarifiers. Campfire. Yeah, I said homeless. I believe it. So somebody could have been believing what somebody said about um uh um I'm I'm finna say somebody could have been leaving what somebody said about leaving somebody oh I'm a better person because he, somebody could have been believing what somebody said about um a divine feminine. Somebody could have made up some fucking lies about a divine feminine. Yeah, but you know what I feel like this divine feminine they knew with this bird I keep getting like. Something was being repeated. It's like everything that somebody... Somebody has the ability to hear what people is talking about them. That's what the fuck this is giving me. Like how your power tells you what somebody said or what they said. You literally... I, it's not. It's more than like just hearing somebody's thoughts. It's it's more... And they watching too. But it's more... It's a, it's a, it's a bald-headed man that's watching a lot of shit go down. I don't know if he's Caucasian, dark skin, Mexican, Latino, whatever, but he's bald. And he's watching everything go down. 
but I was getting like um somebody told some lies on a divine feminine. The birds and the bees, all and I know you've been so good to me. If this world was mine, okay, thank you, High Power, bringing that in for me. But let me get back to what I was just saying. Because somebody here, they could have moved away from somebody because they believe something. They did something here. Whether somebody's homeless, they put somebody out. They could have moved away from somebody because they was believing what somebody else said. Like, say, and say somebody left somebody because of what somebody else said. Or this is somebody that could have left somebody who lied about something that somebody said. Because we have, I'm a better person. Because of you. And I'm hearing, um, I'm a wreck without you. Back to the Spongebob energy. You know, the campfire song. So somebody definitely could be camping out. Or somebody could be homeless. Uh-uh, don't write on that with that mark. Don't write on that with the pencil. Because you're going to mess it up. Yeah, you write on the color. Yeah, or you could use your chalkboard. Or you use the, the, the you get you a, a color page. Um, one of those. She didn't walk in there already. Anyway, but um, but this is what it's giving me. Somebody is nervous to get close to you. I wanna get next to you. Somebody is. Y'all know I'm getting when this world was mine. You know, on the wood. If y'all ain't never seen the wood, when he he got uh close to her, he's like, oh no, I'm about to explode. I'm about to explode. And, like, they was dancing, and, like, she was like, uh, he moved away from her. <laughs> he moved away from her because he was getting hard. He was finna come. And it's like, dang, you finna come already? Like, somebody get a very strong erection. Like, they, they, they find somebody so fucking attractive. That's what I'm getting, though. Like, somebody's so attracted to this divine feminine, like, I'm getting humble to humble to. again. Like somebody's like daydream. They is like, I don't know. They just be like, I don't know. Like they just zone the fuck out. They somebody could be like really good at like imagining shit. They could be really somebody could be having sex in the astro realm. Like I don't know. Somebody could be thinking about all kind of shit. Like, but I feel like somebody whether they don't want to get too close to you or they want to get close to you. Um, but maybe they feel like um. Like, this could be somebody that don't want to get too close to you because they don't want to have an hard. They're going to be embarrassed. Like, if y'all end up having sex or something, this man going to have to get it off a couple times before you have sex with him. Because he's going to be already ready to come already. Like, that's what it's giving me. Because somebody could just look at somebody all day long. And and with that possum energy is what I'm getting. I probably said dirty. Somebody said somebody was dirty. That they smell, or that they are garbage, or they weak, or something. Somebody was making up so many lies. Like, and you know what I'm getting? Somebody could have been honestly really attracted to this feminine. That's why they made up all these lies. Wow. But somebody on the other hand is like, if this world was mine. Now, somebody want to give you everything. Yeah. I'll give you the flowers, the birds, and the bees. Yeah. Somebody going to give you the world, Aries. Like, I, I, I somebody's going to give you the world. Now, if you were just divine feminine, somebody could have been lying to your masculine about you, if this is you. If I'm talking to a divine masculine, whoever was saying something about your feminine, they were lying. Okay? I don't care what they said, they lied. Wow. Thank you, High Power. It's a strong connection here. And somebody connects through music. This is giving me... I'm also hearing a hopeless romantic. Somebody's very romantic. I was getting that in Gemini. 
Somebody want to take a stroll down by the beach or a lake somewhere? An invitation. Somebody's going to invite you somewhere. Maybe Miami. Ooh! Yo, you definitely could be dealing with a, um... Was that Scorpio or was that Gemini? Gemini, because I was getting sunrise, sunset. Sunrise, sunset. And that's what I'm hearing now. Somebody wants to dance until the sun come up. Or yeah, somebody really likes some music. Or this is just going to be music playing. It's giving me like a, a luau or something like that. Like, you know how you go on a beach and it's just like you go on a ro somewhere romantic. It's just you two, just the two of us. Somebody here is really, they listen to a lot of songs or something. They express themselves through music, though. But I'm, I'm getting like champagne, a nice dinner. Um, Yeah, dancing by the, the moonlight. In the street lights. Somebody could want to dance in the middle of the street. Somebody could want to stop traffic for you. Somebody could just be wanting to shout you to the world like, this is my girl. Damn. Wow. And with this mortality, I was getting mortality. This is mature. I was getting mortality. But you know what? I feel like higher power is helping somebody express themselves. If it's not higher power, it's definitely your ancestors. Helping you express yourself. Bring things into the light. Maybe because it's crazy because we have a letter here and then we have a letter here. Like somebody's literally writing a letter. Somebody could be a little old-fashioned about how they do things. This could be something that's taking a little bit of time. Because it's, it's hard, okay? They could get emotional. I'm also getting something about the dark. Maybe they're doing something in the dark. or This could be symbolic for hiding. Hiding something from somebody or someone. Nothing or no one. So why would you show up so uninvited and change my mind like that? So I feel like somebody's going to write you a letter because they don't want to come and barge in. Or they don't want you to feel like they're barging in on you. But somebody definitely wants to say something and express something. They want to write something to you. This could be a text message. It's like... It's like, it's giving me like, I got that message. I got that letter. Somebody could be mean up somewhere as well. It's like, I got that letter. I got that message. Okay. I got the message. I'm hearing you got the, somebody's like, I got the synchronicities. I got the symbols. I know what you mean. Or like something could be significant. Like that could be significant for somebody. Or this could be like a physical letter. Somebody's writing to somebody. The high powers helping somebody does do this though. Somebody's helping, or your ancestors are helping to word something correctly. This could also be what's taking this letter so long or something like that because you see how it's a long letter, but she got a lot of paper rolled up over there, but it's like she got a lot more to write. I feel like somebody could be erasing a lot and rewriting something. Now, if this is not a letter, then this is a text message. Don't, please don't take it personal, but you want shit, you want special till I made you so. Whether you feel this way, Aries, about somebody, or somebody feels this way about you. And that is crazy because we did see you made me a better person. So somebody definitely feels like I wasn't shit at first. Or the ways, my ways were bad or something like that. Somebody's going to be expressing themselves. Give me something else, high power for Aries. We got a lot. Okay. We got the Queen of Wands, the Queen of Oh, this is somebody could be writing you a letter telling you about an ending. Yeah, because with the Eight of Wands, this is some type of conversation. Um, somebody could have been ne ne negligent. Okay, somebody could have been rejecting something from the gods like higher power was watching somebody reject something 
whatever was going on, her power watched something happen the whole way. Like, literally, y'all. Look at this. You see up there? I don't know if y'all can see or not. But look, there's people. Them ancestors are probably watching somebody reject something. Like, why they reject it? Why they push the cup over? Like, what the fuck wrong with them? Like, this was wish fulfillment. What's wrong with them? I don't know. Something could have been forced against somebody will. Or somebody just wasn't thinking straight. Yeah. Yeah, but I feel like somebody put an ending to something. A certain... Now, these could be two people that, that somebody ended something out with. Somebody could, somebody could be telling you that. Now... Now, somebody could have been rejecting you because of these people. Or somebody was rejecting. I'm also here reflecting. Somebody's reflecting on the decision that they made. Now, this could just be simple as they view you as a queen of wands, a queen of pentacles. Somebody that they highly attracted to that got a lot going on. Or they, they're motivated by their money. Okay, a lot of growth. But they could have did something to you. Really turned their back on you. Really hurt you with this ten of swords. Really lied to your face. Y'all, I'm hearing spit on your grave. Drag, drag me to hell. Somebody could have been trying to plot on, on, a, on your death. And not only that, but they was going to be happy if you would have died. That's just the real. That's why I probably like, why the fuck is they rejecting and y'all keep hearing reflecting. Now they just can't stop thinking about the fact that what they did. Whoa, 1124 could be very significant. What's that, Thanksgiving? Somebody did something on Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving is very significant. They was doing spell work on Thanksgiving or something. Who is this queen of wands? Just clarifying. Who is this queen of wands? Because for some of y'all, I feel like these are two different people. Um, what's this queen of wands type power? Manifestation, meditation. No, this is you. This is how they see you, Aries. God is trying to tell you something. Fake it till you make it. So, they could have been manifesting answers and higher power could have gave them the answers. Or if this is you, Aries, you was manifesting the answers and higher power gave it to you. That somebody was fake, fraudulent. Now, for some of you guys, this could be two different people. They, they, they was fake as fuck. Or somebody was fake in your face and they was lying. And that could have been an ultimate betrayal too. Because Ten of Swords is definitely lies. Like a brutal ending or a brutal betrayal here. We got inappropriate. Yeah, something, against, something was done against you inappropriate. A bad dad has something to do with this. He slash she is good for you in reverse. Wow, and I just said that somebody sat up here and lied on this empress. High Priestess. Oh, High Priestess, Empress. They ain't even come out. That's significant for somebody. But with this, um, I'm hearing this devil worshiper, witchcraft. Somebody was lying and saying plenty shit, dog. He said she is good for you, but it's in the reverse. Somebody was giving somebody bad advice on purpose. Wow. And that's why somebody was trying to, uh, somebody was lying and rejecting. Because higher power was like, why? Why did they, I keep getting that. Like, why would you project a gift? We're giving you a gift. Why would you project, why won't you want the cup? It's because somebody was sitting here lying. But I feel like somebody's trying to manifest a conversation between you guys. Lady in the streets, but I freak like an animal. That's in the reverse. So I feel like. Somebody didn't know something. Like like I said, somebody could have looked at this uh, divine feminine in some type of way. But all in reality, it wasn't even like that. Like like I said, somebody could dress a little provocative or they're a little re revealing or they got this sex appeal to them. Somebody could have automatically thought somebody was a hoe or they got some information from somebody that somebody was a hoe. Like, I don't want to do too much because no well in here. But somebody definitely was inappropriate. And it's giving me because they they was really mad because they like this this, this uh, divine feminine. Mm -hmm. I also feel like if I'm talking to a masculine here, this bad dad also betrayed you as well. 
Um, and I got that in a Scorpio. Um, let me introduce myself. My name. What was that in Gemini? My Scorpio. No, I think that was Gemini. Let me introduce myself. My name is Ho. Yeah. So somebody could have put somebody on with somebody. Ooh, we wishing on a star. I'm here to find out where you are. Wishing on the star. It's in the reverse. This also could be a bad dad that's wishing on a star, wishing on somebody's downfall that something don't happen. Somebody could also be wishing the greater good. Somebody's definitely manifesting. I was getting that. Mm -hmm. Look, we got life purpose. So somebody's coming in and taking over their life, taking their life back. So calling things um, into perspective. Like, um... So then something, something is very significant. There go Gemini. Something very significant about money here. Debit card, bank receipts. Somebody was doing something with somebody money. Are there some type of fraudulent activity that's going on? And all this could be surrounding money. Like literally. The reason why somebody lied and all everything could um all be about money, Aries. And it all boiled down. Like who got more money than who and Maybe somebody felt like getting getting with this divine feminine. Somebody would have been too lucky or they would have had too much. I'm here just throw it in a bag. Da, da. Yeah, so it's like somebody would be getting everything they always wanted. So, wow. I'm always hold you down. Emperor energy. And what's that? Guess again. Think twice. IDK, what they thought. Easy sleazy in a reverse. Yeah. Somebody made this masculine, divine masculine, whatever, made them think that somebody was a slut, like easy sleazy, and that wasn't even like that's wasn't even true at all. Somebody is fucking divine. Ooh, y'all, somebody is so divine. I'm hearing they hold their pearls close to them, and you know what that be? You know what that mean? You know when a woman clutching her curls, her ooh, her curls. Somebody could like to curl their hair. Or somebody can have curly hair. But cu clutching their pearls. I'm getting, you know, like a thief energy. Somebody, this divine, I'm telling you, they connected with divine. They know that somebody's trying to stay, take something from them. And you know what it's giving me? Like, virgin somebody could be actually celibate. And, and somebody's trying to have their celibacy broken. Um, are they only doing this to... I'm also getting somebody could be harassing somebody because they're intimidated. They could be sending people towards this divine feminine. But this divine feminine is so close with the divine, she knows already. I'm telling you, she's clutching her pearls. Like, no, you won't take these from me. No, no. Somebody's like, my body is sacred. What I got is mine. I take control of my body. Like, this is what somebody's saying. Like, whoever, I bet somebody feels so fucking stupid right now. And that's probably why somebody left. Because I'm hearing that campfire song. C-A-M-P-F-R-I-G-F-I-R-G song. Yeah, somebody left. They could have left a situation, people, places, or things. Because they believed something. And so they they feel stupid. Because this is about feminine. It don't matter how somebody... It's, uh, it's it, people See, people judge books by they cover all day long when it be a whole blessing in your face. Somebody said up here and was believing what the next motherfucker had to say. This divine feminine, I'm hearing empress. This empress hold her pearls close. She like, no, everybody can't have what I got. <laughs> I know I got something good. Who? How many women you see walking around with some um pearls on? You don't. They, a lot of times they want diamonds. That's what everybody grab, grab for. But I feel like pearls are more like, it's giving me more sacred, more treasurable. Because just because it's ancient, you know what I'm saying? A, a, probably a nice pair of pearls, you could probably pawn it for a lot of money because no, nobody wear it no more. That's how ancient and sacred it is. This is a divine feminine. This is her. Like, this is her body. This is her. She. This is how she feel about herself. Or this is you. This is how you feel about yourself. I'm sacred. Everybody can't have me. 
Now, don't get me wrong. Maybe somebody went through a certain amount of things in their life that caused them to be this way as well. But it all is divine time. It's all divine purpose. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. That's probably why somebody want to be shy. They want to they wanna step up and be bold about something. Yeah. And that's all I have for you guys. Ooh, reparenting yourself. So, somebody's want to reparent themselves. Because whoever they was learning from, I'm hearing return of the man. Mm -mm. Return of the man. Somebody, daddy, thought they was a pimp or something. I don't know. But I don't know. They was just teaching somebody wrong. Now, this could literally be a divine feminine who was taught wrong by her dad. But I'm getting mostly that this is a divine, a masculine here that was taught wrong about a, the feminine from their dad. Yeah. Somebody's going after their life purpose. They see things clearly now, Aries. And if this video resonated or if you just liked the video, please hit the like button, okay? Um, hit that share button. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Or just share the video with people who you might who might need to hear it if you feel like they might need to hear it, okay? But um, if it resonates, okay, you know, you can like too. But however, okay, um... I just really appreciate you guys tapping in, and I hope that this message helps. Um, send in love and light to everybody. See you in the next one, family. Take care of yourself. Bye.